Not think about it yet and achieve proper compaction and make the whole tire look inflated, right. then check the load. Right. So more inflated on that side. Yeah, you want it to not have a flat lick but have an inflated lick. So here's the, and here's the deal with tires. Compaction is more important than level. Alright, yeah. Compaction and inflame. Okay. Okay. So think about that stuff first. Achieve proper compaction. Make sure the tire is in plane. Then look at the level. If it's not level, who cares? Who cares? In all my life, I've never seen a perfectly level tire. It just doesn't happen. So, you know, the times that I take a lot of time leveling is the first course and the last course. If you do that, it's going to be pretty good. Thank you, sir. So, is this one compact enough here? So we say like 90%, which... That looks like 85. 75, probably. Woo! Okay. Well, let me show you like an easy technique for getting this like filled up quick. So you don't have to use a lot of like power. Start right out here in the middle. Just let the sledge fall. Now don't stop at that spot until all that earth disappears. See that? It's already starting to like puff it up. Yeah. I'm not using any energy. Just the weight of the tool and repetition, you know? Because if you just go a little here, a little there, it doesn't do anything. You know, so you have to stick to that place until all the earth disappears into the sidewall. You can do this all day long. Right? Right. You know, if you just do that evenly every time and don't fill it again until all that dirt's gone. Stay meticulous about that, it'll be easier to do. Okay, sounds good. Thank you. Okay. You lay a bunch out and then, you know, look at it. But now we have to bring up the rope, the, the that. The string. The string. Put it here. Okay, one quarter of a inch back. One and a half. One and a half. One and a half inches. One and a half inch back. So it has to be like this. Okay. But, you know, for now, while we're pounding this one, if you go to here, yeah. With your level, yeah. we're three inches back. Okay. Oh, that's what we wanted to know. Three yeah. inches back. Five centimeters for two points. Five centimeters. Okay. So we could start with these. Did I see you? My what? Oh, uh, sure. Metro. 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 No, sé si así se dice. I don't even know if that's how you say it in Spanish. I thought it was <laughs> El Metro. 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 Maybe I'm wrong. Un metro. Let's make it easy. Yeah, <laughs> we'll go with that. All right, so yeah, if you hold it, plumb off the one, two courses down, the level. Okay. So get the level plumb. Hold your tape on the furthest point out of the tire. Okay. So you're not like trying to hold up here. Yeah, yeah. You don't try to do this. Okay. You want to be holding it right on that furthest point out of the tire. Get this plumb. Three so centimeters. That's three inches. Three inches, that's perfect. Okay. So that's where it wants to be. Okay. So that's an inch and, and a half per course. Oh, okay. All right. Inch cool. and a half. Okay. So now I just check those for all tires. Go ahead and get the cardboard in. And then we check them. Then check. Cool. Thank you. But it really don't move around while we pound them. So really the first thing is just to eyeball it. Okay. Just get it close. Yeah. Like yeah. It's three inches. Uh, yeah. Ah, ese cómo se llama en español? Okay, es un so metro. Es un metro. Ah, metro. <laughs> Thank you.
up, action. Put it on the stick. Third plane here. You're published this week. Huh? You're published this week. Your pictures.